on, Yellow. Come on, Daytona. Good boys. Okay, Yellow, up. We're going to stay right here. No, Daytona. Come on, man. So we met Daytona a couple weeks ago in the vlog, and you just saw a little clip of Daytona here. But Daytona has a great story. Daytona is one of our most awesome alligators here. Daytona actually grew up in someone's house. And so Daytona's a little bit different than everybody else, but he's still an awesome alligator. Come here. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Come here. I sure do love you. You're a good boy, Daytona. Yes, you are. No jumping. And I wanted to tell you Daytona's story because it's pretty amazing. Daytona grew up in a house. He didn't have access to real sunlight. Everything that's a reptile needs real sunlight in order to make their bones strong. If they don't, they fill with phosphorus. So they might look like they're healthy, but they're absolutely not. People should never have alligators as pets. It's not a good idea. And in the state of Florida, it's illegal. They are cute when they're little, but they always get big. Don't they, Daytona? He looks different than all the other alligators here. His face is squunched up. His bones aren't quite as strong, and he definitely doesn't have as many teeth as everybody else does. I'm trying to do this little dance so I can tell you why. <laughs> People shouldn't keep alligators in their house. So alligators definitely don't make good pets. And you know, they're really cute when they're little. But I'm, <laughs> I'm abandoning Shu. <laughs> It's all right. It was a good call on your part. Not only does Daytona live in there, but a big old Cuban crocodile does too. So when I had to abandon ship, that's why. I love the alligators and they're a lot of fun, but man, crocodiles ain't no joke. <laughs> Michael, let's go to Adventure Hour. Awesome, let's do it. We have a whole crew behind us. Oh, they're happy. <laughs> they're coming. They're going to feed some big gators. Yeah, with us. that'll be exciting. Yeah, I yeah. love it. Keep doing it. That's awesome. <laughs> whoop, whoop. <laughs> Look at little man jumping. He's like, hey, don't forget me. Are you jumping back there, DJ? Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> That's great. Right. Okay, so we're here at Adventure Hour with Michael Brown. Michael, pop your head in. Hey. <laughs> and tell us what your name is. Lexi. And Lexi, where are you from? Georgia. And your name's Jackson. You're the little brother. And why did you guys come to Gatorland today? I wanted to see you. Yeah? That makes me happy. And where did you see me before? Um, on or, <laughs> Oh My Gosh. Oh My Gosh TV? Yeah. Yeah, you know those guys are from Florida? Yeah. We really love them too. We always have a lot of fun when they come here. So say hi to Omar. Hi, hi Omar. Hi, James. Hello. Come here. Which one do you want to feed? You get three pieces. You can throw it to any alligator you want. I think she, Lexi wants to feed Blackwater. Because she saw her in, in the YouTube video. Huh? I'm going to make your job hard today. Okay. Blackwater. Where are you? Hey, big boy. Hey, big boy. You being sneaky today? What you doing over here by yourself when it's time for eating? Hmm? Hmm? What are you doing over here by yourself? What are you doing? What are you doing? Hey. You making noise? You guys know Blackwater by now. Sometimes he just doesn't do what we ask him to. And you know what? We don't try to make him do anything he doesn't want to do. So hopefully Lexi and Jackson and their baby brother DJ will come back soon and we'll get to see them and we'll try it again with Blackwater. I asked my kids where they wanted to go and I said Universal's, Disney, or Gatorland. And they all said what? Gatorland! Gatorland! <laughs> see Savannah! Yeah, and Woo! we have gators in our backyard. So it was all about this place. It is. It's a great place. Yeah. Because we being a <laughs> Mom. Mom, come on. Had a boy. You know this man. His name is Mark, and he is actually my boss here at Gatorland. That's right. And how long have you been working here, boss? Uh, 20, 21 years now. Right. 21 years. And so he's going to guest in the vlog today because we are going to bring out some amazing animals, our smallest Cuban crocodiles. I love these guys. Ram and Daisy. <sighs> 
I love Rom and Daisy. Cuban crocodiles love to jump. Rom, up. You sit. Up high. Up high. Come on. Jump, boy. Adam, go ahead. He's such a cool little crocodile. Oh, I love Cuban crocodiles. Good boy, Rom. That's a good boy. Yeah, man. Good boy. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> Easy. I've been training him to jump too good there, huh? Rom is Ricardo's son. He's about four years old. He's a great little Cuban crocodile. He's learning so much. He learns how to hold, how to get in the water. We're teaching him how to jump. And he's got his sister in here named Daisy. Who's trying to eat me? Yeah, I know. There that. she is, Daisy. She's kind of following too. Yeah. Mom and Daisy are brother and sister, about four years old. They're uh, the daughter and the son of Ricardo, like I said, and just great, cool, cool little Cuban crocodiles. You can't come out. You can't come out. He disagrees. Rom, watch out. Rom, hey, Rom, come on back over here. Where are you going? Come on, Rom, come on, come on. Over here, add a boy into the water. Water, Rom. Water, come on. Good boy, right there, good boy. <laughs> That's Cuban Crocodile Training 101 right here at Gatorland. That's a good boy, Rom, yes. Uh. Rom and Daisy are so incredible. How much fun was today? It was super fun for me. I really hope you're liking these vlogs. Make sure you check that like button if you do. Ring that bell for notifications so you get to see when the next one comes out. Should be every single day for the month of December for a Vlogmas. And as always, tell all your friends about us, subscribe to this channel, and we will see you tomorrow. Bye!